TFNN. Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman doing the 1 p.m. news uh, cast. I am the host of the Tiger Technicians Hour, 12 to noon, every, 12 to 1 o'clock every day, and also the author of the opening call. So let's go. The Dow's down 30 points at 27,754. This is going to be very interesting because you can see in the left side chart, you have a little rectangle out of six sessions, the last six sessions. So it depends on today's close. But so far, we've got three little tiny doji candles that look like a plus sign in the middle. It says that unless there's a real something to to jar and spark a, a new buying frenzy in the Dow, um, there's a lot of resistance up here into the 27,900s. A break into 28,100s by next week would be really positive. But it looks like it's struggling right now. But it must hold 27,500 to 400 support over the next two weeks. So right now, holding quite nicely. The S&P at this particular point didn't. The Dow made a new all-time high yesterday. S&P is kind of struggling. It hasn't done that. Very close to all-time highs at 3,092. The MACD is turning down but hasn't crossed negative. And stochastic is turning down but still strong at 90 percent. So it's going to be price movement that changes the whole uh, directional area. Unless it closes under 3,085, I'd say 3,083 in the next couple of days, it's still going to be sideways for a little bit longer. And you've got the uh, QQQ, the NDX 100, trading at this particular point down 50 cents at 201.09. A lot's going to be depending on uh, the applied materials earnings this afternoon and NVIDIA after the bell, because that'll in impact the SMHs, the semiconductor index, which in turn will impact the QQQ. So above 202.21 would be very positive. Under uh, 199.50 says be careful, a little bit of a pullback coming. IWM, same thing at 158.37 of 22 cents. It's just kind of stuck in a range. But gold had a very good move. What is gold telling us? It's up nine right now at 14.72. If it can trade over uh, 14.85. By the end of tomorrow or by Monday, that'll say, hey, gold is back in play. It's back in that range. You remember the rectangle range we were looking at? And the dollar in the meantime is a little bit weak today. It's down 18 ticks at 98.18, but it's been holding quite well in this particular range. Crude oil is, and this right, crude oil right now is down 12 cents. Stay tuned. You've got Steve Rhodes coming up. You've got Dave White coming up. Then Tom O'Brien. Have a wonderful day, and uh, we'll see you tomorrow.